this is Mr. Aiden. This is the 2024 AP Chemistry exam free response question number five. This is a four point problem and this is the solution guide to this question number five. You can see it starts off with an equilibrium reaction. That's something to keep in mind. We have hydrogen gas and iodine gas making two moles of HI gas. It's an equilibrium. Something else to keep in mind, the delta H is negative. It's an exothermic reaction. A is asking for the equilibrium constant expression, which means I'm going to put the product HI in brackets on the numerator. It's going to be squared since there's two moles. On the denominator is H2 gas times the I2 gas, and that's going to be worth one point for A. Now B is saying we're injecting some of the H2 and the I2. It's starting to move towards equilibrium, and they gave us the quotient, the reaction quotient, the Q, is 0.67. So I took a look at my equilibrium expression, and I took a look at the particle diagram, and can you see there's two moles of the iodine, the I2, and there's three moles of the H2. So I plugged in two and three on the denominator there. When you multiply that equals six, you take your algebra, six times 0.67, that gives us four, which means HI, what squared equals four? It's gotta be two, which means I need to draw in two particles of HI, and that's what I did right there. I drew in two particles of HI, and that's going to be a second point for part B1. Now, B2 says a student monitors the number of moles of HI, and it says hypothesize an experimental change that could be applied, we're talking Le Chatelier's principle, and to the system to result in more moles of HI. You can see it came to equilibrium, and then you can see the moles of HI went up. So there's a couple different ways to make the HI go up. We could add H2, we could add I2, or we could reduce the HI, and they did not want us changing. They didn't want us adding any more HI gas to the system. So since it's exothermic, what they really want us to do is, if the temperature is lowered by removing heat, by placing it in this reaction on ice, the reaction will shift towards the products. The Q will be less than the K, and it's going to start to produce more HI gas. So we got to lower that temperature, and that's going to be a second point, or a third point, sorry, a third point. And then the last part of this problem is after equilibrium is established, the mixture is transferred to a larger container. This is all about Le Chatelier's again. And what would happen to the moles of HI? They would remain the same, because as the volume increases, the pressure is going to decrease. That's Boyle's law. Therefore, the reaction will shift towards the greatest number of moles of gas particles. That's Le Chatelier's principle. And since there are the same number of moles of gas on the reacted some products, there's two total moles on the left, two total moles on the right, the number of moles of HI will remain the same. And that was an equilibrium problem for 2024 AP Chemistry exam. Check out MrAiden.com. It's all your AP Chemistry needs. Thanks. See you later. Bye.